One of the other common things that people complain about with Excel, uh, with Excel, with Outlook, is the fact that you can't typically save your email messages into a folder that relates to a customer, for example. So most of the time, if you wanted to save this email, you'd have to print a copy out, put it in a hard copy file, or maybe do a scan, something along those lines, um, or just put it in a folder. Uh, in your navigation pane. But there is a way that you can actually save this email into a folder onto your system. And that's by going to File and Print. Now, when you go to File and Print, it shows you your email. And from here, if I click the drop arrow, and I'm just making sure I've got the right screen, I'll just click over here, here we go. So uh, I did file print. From here, I'm going to click the drop arrow and you can see this is what's going to print out. Now, you may or may not have this option, but it's usually there by default as part of Windows. Microsoft print to PDF. Now, if you choose this option and you choose to print, If you choose this option and you choose to print, it will take you to a folder and enable you to, um, hang on, uh, file print. <laughs> Helps if you don't actually click the print button. Click the drop arrow here, print to PDF. And when you click print, it pops up and gives you a folder and uh, encourages you to save it to wherever it is that you want to save it to. And uh, you can then give it a name and save it and it automatically saves as a PDF. So that's a handy way of saving your file uh, as a PDF so that you can actually put a copy of it into a folder on your network drive that relates to a particular client.